Who is 30 feet tall and has a blue ox? Paul Bunyan, of course. The legend of Paul and Babe is coming to the historic Bemidji Theater this week. And intern Alexandria Lester explains how arts grants funding is what made this play possible. Lights, camera, action. The legend of Paul and Babe is coming up this week. But where they got the funding for this play might surprise you. We as a collective people decided to put some of our tax dollars to work to two areas that we as Minnesotans really value, which is the culture and the art. Bellavo is a recipient of a grant from the Region 2 Arts Council. It helps pay for the costumes, the musicians, and renting the Bemidji High School Auditorium for the play. The grants support we, the artists, so that we can bring our visions to life, and it enriches this entire community. You have to go through a process to apply for the Region 2 grants. They look for artists that meet certain criteria. Quality of the artists, arts that you're doing, um, connecting with the culture of this area, this region. Bellavo was approached by the Chamber of Commerce to find a play on Paul Bunyan because it is the 75th anniversary of the Paul and Babe statue. It's a big piece of our culture up here is the whole history of the lumber industry. The Legacy Art Grant offers different kinds of support for the arts community with mentorships, general operations, art programs such as plays or workshops, anything to better or showcase the artist's talent. And I think Babe here is ready for his close-up. The Legacy Funding has done a huge amount to bring the arts into the community in terms of education, in terms of access, and in terms of arts and cultural heritage. The Region 2 Arts Council is a granting organization that supports art and art activities in five different counties in northern Minnesota. We're making the arts accessible in a big way and also very visible. Daler Setter says the Region 2 Arts Council is looking forward to seeing the play that Bellavo is producing. He's got an interesting cast of young people who she's been working with on developing the play, the musical. A play that was funded through a grant so that we may enjoy the culture and history the play has to offer, celebrating the 75 years of Paul and Babe. With this week's Community Spotlight, intern Alexandria Lester, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.